I'm James John, and I... I'm <laughs> just kidding, I'm sorry. Sorry, go ahead. This is all you. Oh, you make me laugh. Okay, uh, you ready? Hi guys, Heather Valentine here. I'm with one of my most fun clients, James John. We just recently sold him his Lambo. Yes. So why Lambo? Why not? No, I'm just not. Um, of all the brands though. Of all the brands, um, I think since I was a little kid, saw the movie, right? Um, Cannonball Run, and I just loved uh, the Countach. I loved all the different cars uh, that Lamborghini has. But it's, it's the culture, it's the brand. I'm a Taurus, so I just have a connection it's with it. I just have a connection with it, and it's about a brand. It's, it's, my, it's what I represent myself as. So he walked in one day, we got to know each other pretty quickly, yes. and well, we had to. <laughs> you've become one of my favorites. Yeah, he's just always so much fun. Such great yeah. energy. Right now, you're tired. I can tell. I am tired, <laughs> but but you know what? Can help out the tiring? Some huh? robot dancing. Yeah, <laughs> we did that. <laughs> so anyway, this was your first time on the track. Right? First time on the track. What was Loved that it. like? I don't know. I kept passing everybody. Yeah, I saw you're a badass out there. Yeah. You're yeah. just like flying by them. You Listen, have no fear. I have no fear. I'm an 80s kid. You know, back in the day when we were 80s, you know, we had cinder blocks, a piece of wood with like nails coming out of it, lighting on fire, going over with our BMX bikes. And you know, but that was it. That was the culture. And, yeah. and this kind of brings that culture back in here on the track. And I get to go as hard as I possibly can. I forget about everything in life and I enjoy myself and just keep it safe. But yeah. yeah uh, I mean, and the instructors were great for that, right? I think they amazing. ran a great event. Super safe, super Absolutely. fun. I told them to yell at me because I'm go. I'm going to push this car so hard because yeah. it wants to be pushed. It doesn't want to sit in the garage all day. But uh, yeah, I pushed it as hard are good and Was I love it. At you? Uh, yeah, <laughs> good. I want him to yell at me. Yeah, that's awesome. But I kicked Great. ass. So, so um, I've been asking a lot of people today uh, what they think about the term garage queen. People who buy cars and they just buy them to look at them and sit in the garage. <sighs> well, you know me. Yeah. Like, I don't judge people. <laughs> that's that's true. them. That's true. But that is not me. I cannot do. I have many friends cars and they just keep them in the car in the garages and they don't want them to get dirty they don't dust to me they're not it's art at that point it's art you yeah. got to drive the hell out of your car i drive yeah. this as a daily this is a daily drive for me yeah. so i drive it everywhere go everywhere with it i love it so i don't want to judge anybody if that's their thing if cars keep them out of trouble and they're yeah, being yeah. positive and good it's all good i really yeah I'm but you love a, to enjoy it i love i have to be in it i love people driving it i let everybody drive my car because yeah. i want everybody to experience lamborghini i want everybody to feel the quality of the just the engine the everything i yeah. just love it it's an awesome visceral feeling when you drive a lamborghini like, it's, it's, there's nothing like it yeah, absolutely so um there's a lot of aspiring owners out there that watch my channel yes. you know they're entrepreneurs they're you know working on their journey to success to yes. get a Lambo. Yes. What advice would you give them? Because you're a you're a new Lambo owner. Yes, 100. percent I would say live your joy. I don't care what you're doing in life. I don't care how much you get paid. I think when you start following your joy, it puts you in a certain frequency, a certain what God wanted you to do, regardless of the, how much you're getting paid. You will find that path that will. Bring success, bring wealth, success right? already to you. So when you're successful in what you're doing, the success of money will come to you and friends and family. How many people I've met along the journey of me just following my joy, that's all I've been doing is just follow my joy, always there for others, be courteous to others, love everybody. But following my joy has brought me this Lambo, it's brought me all my success, has brought me everything. So yeah. it's to live your joy every single day, keep in that frequency. Yeah, Always. when you're passionate about, about what you do and 100%. you know happy to wake up and go do what you do, then absolutely, it will come. yeah. There's never a day you have to work. That's I know this about you because you told me this. You keep like a vision board or something, right? One hundred percent. Okay. Yeah, so that's, that's why cool. I get all my toys. Yeah. One hundred percent. So, really quick for everybody out there, it's very easy. I write myself an email, and uh, for me, it's Taurus. So I just put Taurus in the subject, and I put down everything that I want in my life, and it usually starts all with health family, love, security, you know, all that. And then you can start putting in the toys. So I do have a Bugatti in there that we'll have to do some work with, okay? But it's everything from private jets to, there's, there's no 
some limitations. And it's true because now I'm looking into getting a jet, believe it or yeah, not. It's yeah. the craziest people go, come on. I just looked it's, into jet sharing too. Like, yeah, there's you know? so many opportunities and you never knew. So I look at the email every week. It comes, you know, I clean up my emails. I read it all over again. And then I even print it out and put it next to my bed. And every couple of nights, I just look at it. I envision it because I have a Subaru as well, but I would always picture driving a Lamborghini. That's all I would do. And here we are on the track today. So yeah. the universe doesn't know the difference between what's real and what's not. It's yeah. just energy and yeah. it becomes into reality. And that's how it and works. You don't really have to worry about how, right? That's never kind of the worry law of about how. Thing. It's just put it out there and the universe will figure that out. Listen to her. Never, <laughs> honestly, never figure out how I'm going to get there because then it takes you away from actually concentrating on getting it. That's number one. So you're yeah. 100% right. Okay, cool. I love it. All right, that's great advice for those that are out there watching. Uh, what's been your best memory so far with this beast? Eating buffalo wings in it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> so you guys all have to check out James' channel. He does a lot of crazy stuff with his Lambo. Yes. He eats buffalo wings. Uh, oh, we went to Starbucks. Yes, and, we did a we yeah, did a video. Like, he lets like random people on the street drive his car. So you'll have to check him out on yep. his own channel. Free hugs, Lambo. Yeah. Yeah. So that's a good memory. And yeah. how about today? How was Today's the track memory? Day? Man, I tell you, I just think it's being around the culture. It's yeah. being around the people. People think with cars like this that everybody's a jerk or a prick or whatever. Everybody's so down to earth. Everybody's so loving and caring. You walk up to everybody. Everybody wants to meet each other. Yeah. And it's really a cool, chill crowd. Wouldn't want to be anywhere else. I love it. And it's all because of you. So I appreciate oh, it. Thank, thank you so you. much. You're welcome. Thank you. You're welcome. I'm so glad to have you in my life and honored to have yes. you as a client. Yes, same here. All right, guys. Well, we are going to check out James' car. But uh, thanks again for watching. I'm so glad he would <laughs> share his story and his advice with you. And as always, if you'd like to know more about the Lamborghini brand, be sure to make an appointment with me at Lamborghini Uptown Toronto in Vaughan. <laughs>